Hey Chili Heads, welcome back to Red or Green. We are so excited that you're here with us today. It's that time of year again, for time for the big game, right? The Super Bowl. And so what we're gonna do today is we're gonna show you how to make a taco bar in about 30 minutes. And we're gonna use a couple of shortcuts to get this done. We're gonna use some pre-made taco shells. I bought a rotisserie and shredded the chicken so that we can use that chicken, spice it up a little bit as a filling. I made the salsas yesterday. Both, both salsas, I made uh, some tomatillo salsa and then my, my salsa recipe. And I took the shortcut by making them yesterday. That way I just have to bring them out and they're ready to go. I'm using some leftover rice to make my Spanish rice and that's gonna come together really quickly. I'm also gonna use some canned beans and add a little bit of my, my salsa so that uh, we flavor them up a little bit. Quick and easy. If you haven't subscribed, don't forget to subscribe. Hit post notifications. That way, whenever we release a new video, you get notified right away. And if there are new, any New Mexican dishes you would like to see on the channel, leave it in the comments below and we'll do our best to get it on the channel in the future. All right, we have everything we need here, so let's get to it. In a large saute pan, you're gonna add two tablespoons canola oil, half a cup of diced yellow onion, and a half a cup of diced green bell pepper. And we're gonna cook this for about three minutes. Then we'll add two tablespoons of our homemade salsa or salsa of your choice, one can of tomato sauce. Now we're gonna add two cups of cooked rice. Now stir everything up until everything is combined. Now set aside and keep warm. Add one tablespoon of canola oil to a medium-sized saucepan on medium heat, along with a 15 ounce can of pinto beans. Two tablespoons of our homemade salsa, or salsa of your choice. And we're gonna cook this up for about 10 to 15 minutes, just until all the flavors combine and the broth thickens up a little bit. Now set your beans aside and keep them warm. Add one tablespoon of canola oil, two cups of shredded chicken to a large skillet, along with one and a half tablespoons of taco seasoning, half a teaspoon of salt, and a quarter cup of water, just to bring the whole mix together. Next, we'll cook our ground beef mixture. Add one pound of ground beef and cook until it's completely browned. Add two tablespoons of taco seasoning, half a teaspoon of salt, two cups of rice quinoa mix, Mix it all up and cook for about five minutes. Now let's heat our taco shells in a 350 degree oven for about 10 minutes. You can make your own taco shells, but again, we were trying to put this together in 30 minutes or less, so we went for quick and easy. We just got some good quality taco shells from the store. Next, we're gonna prepare our condiments. I'm gonna dice up some tomato, shred some lettuce, I'm bringing out the condiments I prepared yesterday, such as my tomatillo salsa, my homemade salsa, and some Greek yogurt or sour cream, other things that you can add in there, or maybe some diced onion, shredded cheese. And you're gonna lay this all out so everyone can help themselves. Enjoy.